What's up guys, Boyle96HD here and we're back with another squad build, our first one of FIFA 13 so I hope you do enjoy it. But uh, today it's a really really nice squad in my opinion, it's a BPL squad with an inform involved in it with one of my favourite strikers who you have seen a review on already and uh, left back which is one of the most expensive informs in the game at the moment. But uh, yeah, today we are playing a 4-3-3 formation and it is a Premier League team and all. Very, very good team, very fun to play with and actually very hard to uh, break down. So in goals today we have Brad Friedel, cost me 5,000 coins, which is a lot of money, but he's actually not overpaid and that is what he is going for at the moment on the market. 77 diving, 83 handling, 78 kicking, 80 reflexes and 83 positioning. Alright keeper, nothing fantastic. I had Lindergaard actually as you can see here on the bench, that's my bonghorner. <laughs> Lindergaard he's actually better, but just for the fact that he's rare I have in Bradfield because I'm a tool like that. But uh, not a bad right alright goalkeeper, he's like decent, nothing more than that. A right back today we have Raphael. Really, really hate this lad in real life, but he's actually good in the game. Uh, good pace, good defending, and good at going up the wings. Four star weak fought, three star skills, and cost me 4.5k. Decent buy, definitely recommend this guy for your right back positioning. Kyle Walker's costing about 10k, and I really don't think it's worth paying that for him. Uh, excuse me, at left back we have the inform Butner. What a story about this lad. 87 pace, 74 dribbling. Got this guy in the web app. At the moment he's going for about 180, 200k. So I paid, yeah, 45,715 coins. Fuck you, Fluid, I'm a trading master. No, but uh, this guy was great. He's great, he is good. He's not worth 200k, he's worth about 100k in my opinion, but I'm not going to complain when he's that sort of money. 87 pace is his main attribute, also his good dribbling too. But 45k, what I paid for him, I am not complaining at all. Very nice profit made on him. At the, <coughs> excuse me, at the other centre back it's Figueroa, Manuel Figueroa, I think that's his name, or Maynor. 78 pace, 76 defending, 74 heading. This guy is like David Luiz from last year, except David Luiz is still going for 7 or 8k. Although he's non rare, don't know how, but this guy's 78 pace for a centre back. He was left back last year, so that's really nice, that is. 1.5k in a 3 4 or in a 4 3 3 formation. Can't complain about that guy, about that, lads, but uh, yeah, with that 77 pace, he's really, really nice in the centre back area. The final centre back today is Chris Smalling. 74 pace, 80 defending, and 75 heading. Cost me 5k, which is cheap. He's going for about 8 or 9 now. Very good, very overpowered this year. Recommend you try him out. The first centre mid is this week's inform. He's a cam, which I had to change him to a centre mid, and then I had to change him to a 4 3 3, which cost me a good, good bit of money. But it's inform Amaro and Fellaini. 73 pace, 82 pass, and 76 dribbling, 82 defending, and 85 heading. Very nice stats, 3 star skills, 3 star weak foot, and cost me 29,000. Plus a Candice CM card, plus a 43 card, so it cost me about 38,000, something like that. But a very good player, very good in the air, and an absolute tank, very strong as well on the ball. And the other centre mid to partner in crime is Cheeky Toyota. Gee, it's the size of his forehead in the picture, he looks like Gervinho. Doesn't look like a happy camera there, but 77 pace, 75 passing, 78 dribbling, 83 defending, and 72 heading. Cost me 4.5k, isn't bad at all, also going for about 6k and now at the moment. But very good and it's very strong to hold back for you and does the job what you want him to do with one of those holding back centre midfielders. The next centre mid you see now is Paul Scholes, finally brought back into the game, absolutely delighted. His passing is so good with his 88 passing on the card. Cost me 4.5k which is not bad at all, I'm making a lot of profit from this actually as I look at it. But his passing, his, he is slow no doubt, but his passing is what I have him in there for. His passing is godly like and I definitely recommend you trying to put him in the centre mid position. Absolute gem. The right or the left wing even. It is Scott Sinclair. 89 pace, 82 dribbling, 4 star skills. This lad was the silver god last year but now we're getting a gold one and he's still absolutely amazing. Great pace, good dribbling, 4 star skills, you can't complain. I've had 24, 20 or 3 games, 24 goals really. I don't know, is it? Oh, I've got 12 goals with him, something like that. But still, he's doing a decent record for me out there on the wing. Very good and cost me, as you can see there, 7k or 6k. I don't know if that's over the top round, but he is a fantastic player to play with, in my opinion. And right wing, we have everybody's going to hate me. It's Daniel Sturridge, but lads, he was overpowered last year, and I'd like to all inform you he is still overpowered and he's fucking awesome. He is so good, good pace, good dribbling, and three star skills. Cost me 6,800, another bargain on this guy, selling for about 9k at the moment. But very good, very pacey, and nice dribbling as well. Very hard for the wing backs to keep up with him. 
Oh, excuse me, sorry about that. But uh, and the final player in this team, it is my favourite player of the game. I've so far uh, anyway. Robin Van Persie, seventy eight pace, eighty nine shot, eighty one passing, eighty four dribbling. I will put a review that I've done on him in the annotation below or in the description below or the annotation above or the description below. But he cost me sixty thousand coins, and the record is twenty four games played, thirty seven goals scored. What an absolute animal! And he really is. He's so good. That's four star skills, four star weak foot. Absolute animal, and I definitely recommend you all try him out. So this team and all cost me. Well, he was sixty. He was forty-five. So that's what ninety give or take a hundred. Fellaini cost me thirty. So give or take, it cost me around one hundred and fifty, two hundred k. But now Butner's worth like one seventy k, and there's a lot of options there. I only have this guy in because he is my left back in the club. I bought him in a four-three-three. So I decided to stick him in the team, lads. So this is my first squad builder, FIFA thirteen. I really hope you enjoy. If you do, do please leave a like and a comment and a subscribe. Don't forget to leave in the comments below who you'd like me to review. Underrated informer by the way will be coming back very soon. And uh, yeah, that's really it, lads. Please like, sub, favorite, comment, whatever. Really appreciate. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter at boyline 6 hd Link in the description below. Facebook page, same too. And that uh, peace. Have a good day and catch you later. Goodbye.